Hello and welcome back to this game. Um so Yeah. Uh uh Yeah. I felt like I'd be able to fight on my own. It's true, the pain subsided for a bit for a bit at, at that time. But now I feel like it, it tripled it. Now I feel it triple in force. It hurts so bad. This sucks. Ejected. I reach I reach out for the shelf of my medicine. I, sw I swallow the, p the pills one after another, chasing away, chasing away the unpleasant visions that keep floating up in my memory. And yet, my mind still draws a terrifying picture. Lumps of co not coagulated blood and transparent coating travel down my esophagus, scratching its soft walls, leaving behind furrows. I shake my head violently. I don't care if, if it makes me feel dizzy or worsens my pain. I just don't want to. I just don't want to think to think about something so repulsive. Toss the last pill in the air and catch it with my mouth. Hmm. I lie on the floor. I look at the I look at the ceiling. I can clearly hear water running in the metal pipe up there. Or metal pipes, I mean. Uh, I hear the cre the cracking of of concrete blocks that w that will someday surely fall on my head. Um, that's dark. I guess I don't know if dark is the word I'm looking for, but still, uh, but I'm not afraid of that at all. I can't imagine my death coming from above. Rather, it's rearing its claws from somewhere below. Waiting for me to lose focus. Huh. Uh. This game is, is much different from the original. No, I've had enough. I just want to lie down for a bit. Yeah, I just chose to say, stay silent. something that I'll regret. I carefully extract my thoughts that are that are yet to be fully formed from my head from my head and lay down lay them down or lay them out on the on the ceiling in order in orderly rows. Now now is my cork board. In hopes of seeing the the whole picture, I switch them from one place to another Pile of them, pile of them on top of each other, scatter them around. In the end, I throw them off with my hand, annoyed, and start over. I can't do it. I hate cockroaches. Can I? Can I make them fireflies? Yeah. 
Huh. I don't even have the time to blink before my thoughts the fireflies now. I start worrying, start crawling all over the ceiling on the wrong cord. Farming was whimsical patterns. I can only observe them and wait for the right moment. It's just that moment doesn't come. The mocking sounds of flapping wings coming from the ceiling make, make, make me start to lose my patience. Enough. I hate you. I spring to my feet and scream at the top of my lungs. The fireflies scatter. No way. Uh, I feel like your mom would have heard that and is probably coming down or coming over to here. Whatever. And uh, I don't know if that's a good or bad thing. I don't give a damn. You should options now, not the rude ones. Here I get. Alright. I've changed my mind yet, please. Please don't stay silent for this long anymore. I'm having a hard time without your help. Hmm. I raise my eyes and look and look at the ceiling once more. Sadly, all my fireflies seem to be hiding somewhere. I need to find them. Our glance around the room. There are too many places for creatures as small as a firefly to hide here. Yeah. There's that noise again. <laughs> That random banging noise. <laughs> I heard it in the first episode. Here it is again. They can be anywhere. Suddenly, I hear a deafening rumble. The clock just hit midnight. It's so late already, but I can't go to I can't go to bed right now. Will you help me? Please tell me you'll help me. I will. I'm not really going to want to bully you. You promised to talk to me. I, I will. What do you mean? You should, you should know it better than anyone else. Right. Oh. Start rubbing my eyes intensely. They're so itchy. My eyes are itchy. I wonder if I tear out all my other itches one after another. All my eyes stop itching. I wonder if I. I tear out all my eyes, one after another. Uh, it's starting to creep me out. 
I need to get the glass, and then, and then I need to have a bath, and then... supposed to mean? Like, what is that supposed to mean? Uh, I stand in the middle of my of the room, my mouth agape, gasping for air, uh, gasping for air. I think I just experienced death. I don't know any other way to explain what happened. But surely, that was surely something. Oh, good, she's alive. I like this character. I like the character, I don't want her to die. I'm glad she's alive. Let's look for the fire, fireflies instead. This house is nice. Help me instead of running your mouth. I've already had enough adventures before we read. I want to do the thing, but the game doesn't want me to. I need to gather my thoughts quickly go to the bed. My thoughts are hiding from me. Me neither. No, 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 no. If I, if I make even the smallest of messes here, I'll, I'll feel really bad. The place is already kind of a mess. So... And all, the, and all the things should st stay in their places, and that's it. adventure game character. Another reference to the previous game. No, those games that have moments when you just look at different objects and, and something inevitably happens. Sounds so fun. Yeah, it does. It would make it even more interesting. And wanna know the best part? You'll be the one doing it. Yay! I, I start panicking as soon as I get in a, in a multiple choice situation. I'll just, I'll just keep changing my mind and end up crying and running away. Do you, do you want that to happen? No, I don't. This, this kind of sad. I go to the middle of the room and I look, and look around. Where would I hide if I were a tiny firefly? Uh, this is so thrilling. My heart gets warmer from the place from the pleasant anticipation what? I look down. After a moment, a small ball of light and warmth crawls from crawls out under my sweater. For some reason I thought there was actually gonna be smoke starting to come from clothes. Yeah. I carefully grab the firefly. It's, 
is pleasantly scorching to the touch. I put it on my shoulder. Okay, uh, I'm gonna end this video here. Have an absolutely amazing day, and bye.